We're at the Candle Industry Convention in Nashville, Tennessee this week, and we're in the trade show at the Novartis Animal Health Display. We're going to talk with Dr. Doug Scholes, professional services veterinarian with Novartis Animal Health, about Manhamia hemolytica in cattle. Well, Doug, we see a lot of respiratory diseases such as pneumonia in the spring. How serious is the impact of respiratory disease in the beef industry? Well, you know, certainly it's probably the biggest drain on profit that we see from any animal health or health issue that we have. You know, certainly we look at, at industry-wide estimates. I kind of like to look at it from the calf perspective. You know, any time a calf comes down with respiratory disease, you know, the range could be anywhere from $40 to $300, and that could be from treatment with antibiotics, loss performance, death loss, et cetera. So it, it's a costly disease to our industry. Now, I understand Manheim, Manheimia hemolytica is the leading bacterial component of uh, bovine respiratory disease. When do we see it, and why is it important to get quick control of it? You know, typically what we see when these calves do develop respiratory disease, usually it's, it's led by a viral insult, usually IBR, BVD. And then we get the secondary bacterial components, things like Manheimia hemolytica. The thing people need to realize is that, you know, that bacteria is carried by all cattle. And so if those calves go through a period of stress, um, go through a viral uh, insult as well, that's when that secondary bacterial pneumonia can develop. Now your product, Nuplura, is an exciting development from Novartis Animal Health in the fight against respiratory disease. What makes it so powerful? Well, what's really unique about Nuplura is that it's, it's a recombinant vaccine and what, what that means is that it allows us to put what, what we really need for a good immune response, primarily the outer membrane proteins and um, uh, the leukotoxin, the genetically altered leukotoxin, is going to provide a very safe and effective vaccine.